Springtime is coming, and so I'm gonna share some spring transitional pieces to kind of get you in the mood for the warm weather that's coming. Hopefully, keep watching. You cannot go wrong with a sweater dress. Sweater dresses are incredible, and this orange one, it's like a burnt orange. Ooh, it has this cute square kind of sweetheart neckline. The actual material is very hefty actually. So I could see this also being really nice for winter as well. So it's a great transitional piece. You can put some tights on. It is a long midi length. It has a split down one side on the right side if you're wearing it. The sleeves are belt. It is just Oh, it looks so good. I don't know what it is about sweetheart necklines, but <laughs> I'm obsessed. They look amazing on. They look very feminine. They show a very feminine part of the body, the clavicle, you know, the cleavage. It's just, it's a beautiful, beautiful dress. It has a very nice weight to it. As I've said, I got it from Amazon and I am pleasantly surprised at how incredible this dress is. I got another sweater dress and this one, <laughs> you have to put on the hanger like this because you don't want to stretch it out, but you can see it on the screen. It is also a midi length sweater dress. It comes off the shoulders just slightly and it has splits on both sides so that your legs can kind of breathe because it is in the shape of kind of a pencil skirt, but a little bit more relaxed. The most intriguing feature is the bat wing sleeve. And it also has like this strip of fabric on the back, which I actually really like because it keeps the, the dress together. Now this is a size large and I need it to size down. I definitely needed to size down because it was kind of falling off my shoulders a little bit too much. So I normally am a size large, so I would say size down in this dress, but the color is very spring. It is just this really beautiful apricot color that just screams spring and sun and flowers. I absolutely love this shade. This color is beautiful. I love the crisscross. It's it's a very flattering dress, um, but I would size down. Ugh, it is the same shape as the other dress, a midi length, bat wing sleeve, crisscross kind of off the shoulder number, but I sized down in a medium because I was curious, okay? I made like two, three orders and the medium is the one that fits me the best. It's a midi length, long, it has slits on the sides and of course that bat wing sleeve. Now, some people love the bat wing sleeve, some people don't. I'm kind of in the middle. It depends on how the dress fits and I feel like this dress in particular fits me well enough that the bat wing sleeve works. I just think it's really cute. So cute that I wanted to see in the mini skirt version. And so I did. I ended up getting the mini skirt version and you, this color is so beautiful, is it not? I mean, it's giving the same thing as the long one, just shorter, sexier, flirtier, more, you know, for going out, maybe like a cool night out so that you're not freezing. And it's just beautiful. I mean, you could put some tall boots on if you'd like. You can do a little heel, a high heel. It's very versatile actually. And of course with that tie, you can do whatever you like with it. This color on my skin, I'm just saying, it's beautiful. By the way, I wanted to mention this. This is shapewear. Yes, I know. How did I fit into it? I have no idea, you guys. I nearly lost my life trying to get into it, but this does all that it needs to do. It sucks you right in. It has some boning in it. It's a thong. I mean, it is, <laughs> it gives everything you need because sometimes when you wear shapewear, right? If you got a little booty booty, you know, it, it kind of like cuts into your butt and then you have this like, divot in your butt sometimes. Um, the only one that I've seen that hasn't really done that is skims, but then skims, sometimes the seam is still visible. Even though it's not like cutting into your butt, you can still see that seam. And so I wanted a thong version and I found this on Amazon and it is, I mean, <laughs> it's gonna suck you right in. I love it. and. It just looks really good. So I wore this under all of those dresses. I was looking batty addy, okay? Given body yaddy. I thoroughly appreciate this. I will probably buy a second one just because 
it's that good. Oh, and I got it in, I wanna say a large. So when you're working with transitional pieces, sometimes you can take something that's spring, summer, and just put a little something under it that turns it into something for cool weather. What I mean are turtlenecks, right? This is a black turtleneck. It's actually more of a mock neck because it doesn't fold down. It's very thin. Um, it's a body suit and it is like one of those pieces that you can wear alone or you can layer. It's black so it's not see-through which is great um, and the body suit part doesn't dig into your booty which I really appreciate because sometimes I mean they get oh. Come on now. <laughs> um, you could wear this with, you know, a dress, a skirt, some jeans. Um, it's just very basic, a really, really good basic. From the same brand, and this is also on Amazon, you guys, this is a white one. Now the white one is see-through, okay? Um, it's a mock neck, it has the same stretch. It's very thin fabric, but I wanted that. I needed a thin fabric because again, this is to layer under things, but honestly, a little bra action ain't never hurt nobody either, you know? So I like that it's thin. So I could see this from like transitioning from spring to summer as well. Um, and it's just a basic, it's just a basic. Like people just need basics. And I didn't have any that I liked. I had got some from another company a long time ago and they it just shrunk really bad. So um, this, this is, I, I'm, I'm loving this. I got this one from the same company, but it actually has, it's a little bit more substantial. You know, it has a lot of stretch to it. It's a size large. All of these are size large, a long sleeve bodysuit as well. It does not cut in. I'm really liking this brand. It's on Amazon, it's called Mango Pop. It's one of their like top sellers and it has thousands of reviews, positive. This is a scoop neck. The other ones were mock neck and they have a bunch of different styles and colors. And I got white because it's basic. Um, and I just need a basic white shirt. Um, it is see-through. And so I would definitely say wear a nude or black. I kind of would lean a little bit more towards like a nude, like your true nude color. But nonetheless, it's it's a very affordable basic that you can just like switch out every season. So um, this is gonna be my new brand for basics. I, I really like these a lot. Did y'all know I did not have white jeans? <laughs> I needed some and I didn't want them to be expensive. I wanted them to be affordable because like, how often am I gonna wear white? I, I don't know. I have a son that is, a, you know, he's four. <laughs> I'm nervous y'all, but I needed a white pair because white just goes so well. Anyway, this is a skinny jean. This is from the Amazon Basics collection. It has a little bit of stretch to it. These are a size 12. Right now I'm like a size 12, but I kind of fluctuate between 10 and 12, depending on how I'm doing in, in, in the kitchen and in the gym. Um, right now I'm a 12. And I would say, look at the measurements. Because if you have a little bit more thigh, a little bit more booty, you probably want to up go up a size. Um, yeah, yeah, I would I would say go up a size if you got some thighs and booty, okay? If you don't, then you could probably, you know, stay at, stay at your normal size. But these are cute. I just needed a basic pair. They go with a lot of different things. Um, I don't have a pair of white jeans in, in white. White jeans are like quintessential spring, you know? And then for summertime, it'll be white shorts, you know what I mean? So white jeans for springtime, transitioning into it. I mean, it's just, if you don't have a pair of white jeans yet, you should probably just get one, right? <laughs> that was me talking to me. Mm -hmm. Let's get into these accessories, darling. Look at this. Look at this purse. Look at this purse. I saw it and I was like, oh my God. Like I love purses that they have to have, first of all, they have to be small, medium, medium and small. They have to be able to go crossbody, and they have to be unique. Either a bold color, an interesting shape, some cool artwork, and this fits the bill, okay? You can hold it, it comes with a strap, it, it zips open and I mean, just, you can, I'm so excited about this bag and it comes in so many colors. Red, blue, white, yellow, like, I mean, so many, so many colors. I am obsessed with this. I know some people, this is not gonna be everybody's cup of tea. I just like interesting. Give me art. 
give me drama give me you know like a handbag and one thing i love about handbags it doesn't matter what size you are big small you lose weight you gain weight you're pregnant you're not like a handbag is always there it doesn't matter okay i swear if i ever started anything in the fashion industry it would be handbags i think i think it'd be handbags this is so cute look at the little pearl earrings i mean she looks like me like my style you know just ah she's so cute i do want to share with you guys dkny is also on amazon you guys and look at look at okay the yellow one is no longer available but i, I think i saw it on another website so if, if it's still available i will link it i also have the white one it comes in black um and what else an orange like this burnt orange is just so pretty i just wanted to share these with you all um, in case you're looking for a bag that's structured that's small um that doesn't have like any metal on it there's no metal to these so you don't have to worry about wearing gold or silver they're very lightweight they're full leather um they have a pocket in the back i mean they're just that pop to your outfit you know just a look you know especially when you want to wear like a bold heel or something just a look you know i love oh, can, can you guys tell that accessories are like my favorite thing okay more i saw these heels okay originally i saw them in like a yellow like a various shades of yellow and i was like oh that's cute but then they didn't have my size available but then i saw these and they are like a sling back heel. Look at this. It's a little kitten heel, okay? I wear a size 10. And then the front has all of these colors. <laughs> okay, I originally wanted to get these <laughs> because of those like um, cerulean, like kind of royal blue dresses. I could see these going with jeans as well, even if it's like a large, like, wide leg or a bell bottom and like the just the color just peeks out from the front like just these are darling this is what i'm talking about this is a heel okay i mean not a heel height but it, it, this is a, this is art okay this is art and it doesn't have to be super duper like high end for me to be impressed i like high end i like low end it doesn't matter just impress me bring the drama you know these are cute these are so cute and my next handbag you know it's gonna it has to be cold Gaia. well my next handbag is marc jacobs but you guys are gonna see that one um later let me just keep going hold on so these gold earrings they are so architectural so cool they also kind of rem remind me of like they're giving kind of like a 90s feel to them i don't know why they are so promising but i actually think i'm going to return them because they just don't look good on my face shape i had such high hopes i think that they're really fun and they look really great from the side but to the front i just don't feel like it flatters me i don't know you guys can let me know but i wanted to offer these up in case you're into them i don't know if these are genuine leather or faux leather but it does not matter to me these square geometric shape are like art they are lightweight but they still give all the drama of something that's heavy and bulky you know they have like a hook <laughs> what is that called the backing is like a little hook, you know what I mean? Anyway, um, I just think that these are fabulous. They look great on, they're black, but they're not like that plastic, you know what I mean? Like, I just feel like the leather elevates it a little bit more than going for like a shiny plastic, you know? I feel like these scream, go to the art gallery, be the art, look at the art. I love these. Another piece of art, another piece of art. Look at this face. Look at this. You can't, look at, just, you can't wear this without getting a compliment. Like, prepare to be complimented. Wear this at a fashion show, wear this at an art gallery, wear this, just, at work, day to day, doesn't even matter. They look like art and I love them. I don't have much more to say. I mean, you see they're gold. They have this like eye and lip structure, half of a face, like fantastic. It is very gloomy out and this is brightening my day. And lastly, I just wanna mention this lipstick. This is by Minted Beauty. They actually have a store on Amazon as well, you guys. 
Smells like vanilla. Kind of smells like a MAC lipstick, if you guys like that smell. It's called Foxy Brown and it's glorious. This really could be somebody's nude. This could be your nude, okay? It looks brown on me, but if you have a deep, beautiful, like chocolate, you just, the, the melanin is popping. Y'all know what I'm saying. Y'all know what I'm saying, okay? <laughs> if that's you, this lipstick might be your nude. Um, It's a beautiful, beautiful color. It comes in this like semi-matte, uh, well, kind of like a matte, satin matte, I don't know what you wanna call this, um, bullet shape of a lipstick, classic, classic shape. Minted Beauty is also black owned, just beautiful, just beautiful, you know? What else did I pick up? <laughs> oh, I picked up the Puff Cuff. I'm not gonna show it to you because it's already in my hair and I didn't film it, but it's basically, can you guys see this little illustration? <laughs> It essentially clamps around your hair instead of you having those elastics and like struggling, especially if you have thick natural hair, just clamps on. One day I will show you probably on my other channel how I kind of do this. Honestly, today it's very messy. That's probably why I didn't film it because it was nothing to, was nothing to see really. <laughs> And then I got some turmeric, turmeric supreme extra strength by Gaia Herbs. I want to mention this because turmeric pills are really great for inflammation. They have like so many benefits, you should look it up. But also this brand in particular has a lot of, like they have a women's balance pill that I love that works, just kind of mellows me out. Like just, mm. and they use a lot of natural ingredients. So I just want to give a shout out to this brand Gaia Herbs. I always get mine from Amazon, but I'm sure you could find it at like probably Whole Foods or something, who knows. Just shout out to supplements because iron in particular and turmeric are bae for me, okay? They're just, they just keep me good. show you today that because I, I have more stuff coming in the mail I have I want to do some outfits I want to do a couple of things for spring and summer and everything I, I definitely want to bring more fashion to this channel because I feel like I've been shying away from it a little bit not on purpose just like I, I have so much footage that I'm trying to get out but subscribe if you enjoyed this video if you enjoy me <laughs> okay <laughs> I also have a natural hair channel if you're interested in that. Um, I will put that link down below as well. Mwah.